I'm Teacher Vivian, <clears throat> and today we are going to be reading Sharing Time Troubles by Grace Macaroon and illustrated by Betsy Lewin. Sharing Time Troubles. It's Monday. It is sharing time. Dan brings his pet, a frog named Slime. <clears throat> you see his little frog? The kids are touching it and even making some faces on the way it feels. I wonder why he called it Slime. Maybe it feels slimy. It's Tuesday. It is time to share. Pam brings her special teddy bear. Here's Pam's special teddy bear she's bringing to share with her class. <clears throat> On Wednesday, Max brings Mexican money to share with his class. So he's got some Mexican money here sharing with his class. He's looking at it like he's inspecting what it says or what kind of picture it might have on there. Kim brings some gold. So she has a gold bracelet with the gold charm. And that charm even has a letter. It's like a letter K. And everybody's interested and looking at Kim's gold on her wrist. Jan brings a bunny. Oh, she brought a bunny to share, which probably is her pet. The kids are sitting down on the ground and they're looking at the bunny as he's hopping around, maybe smelling them. And I even see his bunny cage right there. On Thursday, Sam has nothing to share. <clears throat> no pet, no gold, no money. Hmm. Look at Sam. What do you think he's feeling? I wonder what's going on with Sam. At home, Sam looks at all his stuff, but none of it is good enough. Whoa, look at Sam's room. He's got all kinds of stuff to share. Look at that. What do you think maybe he should take to share? I don't know. Let's find out what he decides. Books, blocks, balls, a baseball bat, cards, and a cap, a cowboy hat. Hmm, just don't know. Sam's little brother wants to play, but Sam has sharing time troubles today. Sam says, go away. Sam's trying to think. That's why. So that's why he's being a little uh, maybe mean to his little brother who wants to play. Sam's trying to think. Maybe he needs just to tell him in another way. I'm trying to concentrate. I need some time alone. Then Sam says, wait, stay, stay. And look at he's giving his brother a big hug. And look at his brother's face like, oh, my goodness, what's going on here? It's Friday, and Sam has something to show. Can you guess what it is? Sam asks, do you know? What do you think he's got in that wagon to share? Hmm, look at the kids all looking like, oh, what's in there? What does he have to share? What did he bring? What's as sloppy as a frog? As hoppy as a bunny, as cute as a teddy bear, and better than gold or money. Hmm. What is as sloppy as a frog, as hoppy as a bunny, as cute as a teddy bear, and better than gold or money? Hmm. What can it be? Jan makes a guess. Dan makes another. I know, I know, says Kim. It's Sam's little brother. So Sam brought his brother to share with his friends. 
I hope you like this story and I wonder what you might have to share at your home. It doesn't have to be something from a store. It could be a picture or it could be like Sam, his little brother.